Hey guys, welcome to this really short tutorial. Um, it's about uh, we want to have this emitter start later and uh, stop earlier. Um, it took a while to me to find out how to delay this because if you just drag and drop around this thing here and logically it should start later now, <laughs> uh, but it doesn't as you see. So uh, here the trick is you have to um, enable this checkbox loop delay. Uh, now what happens, uh, it, it, it first it works and when you change the value here, then you see that your little emitter also moves in the timeline and when you move it around here this value changes. Now this is connected and it actually works. Now the question is how do we stop it um, after a little bit of time uh, because what now happens is it, uh, it, it already stops but it begins again and it has this little pause in between. What you can do, delete first loop only. Now we have for example uh, the emitter and it starts and now it runs the whole time without a little pause or if you want to have it actually stop then just set this to once and now we should see this run for two seconds and then stop yes and when you want to short it then we can shorten it here and yeah everything works like expected now the biggest part for me to find out how uh, how to make this work was the delay actually uh, thanks to the real, real time vfx discord um, yeah, uh, uh, without you guys, I wouldn't have found out. <laughs> but this might be something new to 4.25. Uh, so I'm 4.25. Uh, before, maybe it was different uh, and it was not documented anywhere. So thanks for your help, guys.